Yo, what's up? I'm Dulex, and I'm about to turn this cargo van into a living space. This is a Ram Promaster 2500. It's pretty tall in there, so there's plenty of space to walk around. That's the starting point, so it's time to get to work. floor looks pretty good so I'm gonna get started on the ceiling and the roof next I need to get up there and cut some holes so I can mount a vent a skylight and a couple of solar panels so we can have some power The ceiling is done, so now I'm going to build an electrical box so that I can utilize that solar power in the van.
that's the best I can do. Decided to put the shower up here right behind the driver's seat. So the first thing I'm gonna do is insulate this wall because I'm not gonna get another chance to do that. This is actually the base for the shower, just to give it a little bit of elevation. All of the water that falls into the tub will end up coming down to the drain properly. I'm gonna build a water box in this wheel well area and I'm gonna run the plumbing underneath the bench inside of this wall, which is going to give me the shower faucet coming out here. on the drain portion of this because there's no water tank underneath the van. It's just draining out into the grass.
I'm gonna go work on some insulation. Oh, what the hell? Oh, Jesus. This is ridiculous. You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna head back inside because they said this is gonna melt by tomorrow. So, um, I'm gonna go build the kitchen instead. I need to build this refrigerator into this section of the cabinet right here. So I have an extremely complicated design of a drawer that I'm gonna to put together real quick.
last major piece that I need to have is a place to sleep. So I'm going to make a converting bed so that we can save some space when you're not in the bed and have a little bit more room to move around. At this point, all of the main features in the van are done. So I just need to do a bunch of detail work to make it look nicer in there and make it a little bit more functional. So time to get to work on that.
that was a lot of work, but I finally got it done. This was the first van I've ever made that was someone else's, so I didn't make it in my style, but I still like how it came out. Let me know what you think about it. I've got a tour video coming out for this van next week, so make sure you stay tuned for that. But until then, watch this video right here, because if you liked this one, you'll probably like that one too. Catch you later. Thank you.